Hello and welcome everybody once again. Today we're taking a step back in time. We're looking at the Warhammer Chaos Warrior Halberdier's Regiment. Now, it says here complete regiment for Warhammer. Obviously these can still be used in Age of Sigmar, but I just wanted to take a look as to comparing the old, what's known as Old Hammer, compared to say the new Slaves of Darkness Chaos Wars. I say new, and this is still on a square base, but it is still the um, models that you would pick up. So without any further ado, let's take a look at this old box. So if we look here, where is it? Right here, Copyright Games Workshop 1998. Some of these models, they're just fantastic. Look at those poses. The colors to paint them. And how they come in all these multi-parts as such. This, this, you don't, you don't see this quite as often uh, with so many different parts. I mean, maybe orc boys. Most things now, they're just, you know, that clamshell mono pose. But a complete regiment. So does it say how many models it includes? No, let's just take a look at the box. Let's just appreciate this old box art. Wonderful. Got the horn blower. Look at that horn. And the leader. It's great. What do you got on this side? Oh, here we go. Yeah, so all the additional bits here that we're going to get, I'll show you that. How it all comes in different legs. Your different types of shields, bodies, your arms, different heads. Inside this box is a complete warriors with halberd regiment. The models are constructed from multi-part plastic kits with metal halberd arms that can be assembled in almost infinite number of ways. You choose the combination of the arms, bodies, legs, and heads to create your own unique warhammer regiment. There is also a sprue of skulls, spikes, and weapons, which can be glued wherever you like to add even more variety. Inside, you'll find the special metal parts needed to model a leader, standard bearer, and horn, and horn blower. And then, of course, at the side there, your batch number and everything, and not recommended for children. Okay, let's open this up, the old school sleeve, into this box. Look at these parts. Now I was able to pick this up at a local gaming convention. It was on for a discount. So, Okay, so here we got some additional spikes and, and everything else. Oh, look at these swords. Beautiful. I'm just going to keep going through all these bits here. There's some legs, yeah. Look at that. Games Workshop 1997. Wow. Does that make them 21 years old? These models are 21 years old. 96 for the shields. But like look at look at some of these. The detail, the funny smiles. They're more more cartoony. I mean, it's fantastic. Honestly, you could use some of these to on your uh, like warlord knights, imperial knights, you could for to turn them into chaos renegade knights. Look at these shields; these are great. I'm loving them. There's them heads. Look at this head here. So you can see him from this side. That's a great head there. I could see me using these maybe to make a Chaos Blood Bowl team. I've got a bunch of old plastic uh, Beastmen as well. Legs. It's just so nice that, like the poses that you can put them in. Okay, here, is this the same? I do believe that's the same sprue, right? Yes, they're they're the same sprue. So two of those sprues. More heads. 
So again, this looks like it's, yes, that's the same, same sprue for the heads. Ah, uh, here we go, getting into some of the torsos. 1997. Look at that. Is that the same? Yes. So those are, they're identical. What do we have here? Oh, the arms. Oh yeah, look at those pauldrons. That's great. Just great. Wow. <laughs> They're gonna look very cartoony put together. Oh, I'm loving them. It's the same, but I just, even, even back 21, 22 years, because this is 97, yeah, 21 years ago. The detail, even then. The legs here again, it's the same set of legs. Wow. I just love the nostalgia of these. And again, more body parts, same again. Um, it also came with a movement tray. Uh, those that know Warhammer Fantasy understand, you know, you have all your guys and they move in a tray. That's great, old movement tray. And of course, it comes with the small bases, the square, but whatever, I have enough round bases, I'll just transfer them over. But then here, Chaos Warrior Halberd, Halberdiers. So you can see, I'm not gonna open this blister because I don't want them everywhere. But you get, ah, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna open it. So you get all your metal halberd arms. Those are the same. I imagine they are going to be the same. Let's see if I can find, oh, there's a different one with the multiple skulls. So you can see, that one has multiple skulls on the shoulder pad. That one just has the one. Same with that one with multiple, multiple. There's supposed to be an upgrade pack here. For, oh, there we go. See the double-sided? So that's probably for your champion there. Oh, no. Oh, that's, this is for the champion. There you go. Arm in the air. Morning Star, and then that's for your your standard, your icon bearer, and then there's your horn blower, so your instrument, and there is the champion's head. You can see in the old models, like it literally goes straight into the body. You have your bodies. It just goes straight into it, so they end up with their heads sticking out. Fantastic, the old models. I love them. Yeah, so lots of arms there. We got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. 15, 16 arms. Because it is four times, so there's 12 guys in there, 16 arms. Hmm. Yeah, still. Anyways, that is Warhammer Fantasy Chaos Warriors that I'm going to be using in my Slaves to Darkness army. Just to add that flavor, put them on the table. 21 years old. And there's some guys in our gaming group that these might be older than them. But anyways, I'd like to thank you all. want to hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to get up there. We will have that contest at 500 subscribers. Hit like, share. Most of all, just have fun with it, guys.